de Kansas City. Nos encontramos en la gran apertura del Centro de Cultura de Mary Rose. Doing play and doing the other side of the room. Paint. The teachers. <laughs> One of the first things I did when I came to Kansas City just about 16 months ago was visit this site and it was just a hole in the ground and a vision and, a, and an amazing vision and it's so great to be here today to see it come to reality. Very proud that the state of Missouri helped with the fundraising uh, to build this cultural center. Uh, it looks beautiful, John. Congratulations and congratulations to everyone here. Because I believe in what Maddie Rhodes provides, the service, the community. It's It's been a real honor to, to serve. Congratulations to Maddie Rhodes and to the community for this wonderful facility that I know will will care for our future and really support uh, the community. Um, this, everybody else that's come out to help us because we've had tons of issues along the way, but here we are. And I'm just so glad to be a part of this. I grew up on 23rd and Bellevue and to see all the development and all the impact that has taken place through John and company and the entire team, congratulations. Don't wanna go into how many challenges we have overcome as a team. And I always had this ribbon cutting and this beautiful building, getting awards and being recognized for what is going to be doing. I just had that at the end of the road ahead of me and that's what would get us going. Um, I came to the block party in the summer and just to see the impact that this community has, it's. It's been a wonderful thing and, and thank you for this past year and it's a great experience. Our company is very fortunate to be a part of this and uh, uh, really excited to see this building after all the hoops we've gone through. And thank you so much. I think just the contribution Maddie Rhodes makes to the community just is making this project just a labor of love for us. So thank you very much. On behalf of our board of directors, our team member, our community, I wanna say thank you, David. We're celebrating art, art for the kids, art for me, art for the whole community. Uh, Betty Rose reaches out to all of the Metro Kansas City. So what you see here, you have people on special events come down here that have never ever seen anything like this. They were pioneers in, in uh, showing Kansas City what the Hispanic culture is. My son, when he was in high school, came to Jenny Mendez and said, I want to learn art. He's now a graphic designer, has his master's degree in art, and he has his own business. So we show the kids the path. If they have a passion for something, that art plays a role in that. I'm retired when John Fierro called and said, I need you to be on this campaign. I need you to help me raise money. I said, sure, John, whatever you need, I can be there for you. Yes, yeah, so I was a member of the McCown Gordon team and we were the general contractor on the project. So we built the building. Um, it was it was an amazing experience just to see the unity and the great things that Maddie Rhodes provides for the community. It was a, a very rewarding pro project and congratulations to Maddie Rhodes. Similar to Isaiah, I was part of the construction team that worked on the project, got to know the board members, all the staff, and uh, got to be part of many of their events and get to see how parents and the kids are involved and just where Maddie Rose Arts Center is located across from the school, all the community here. Um, it's, it's really important for the parents to be involved um, and that's what, you know, just the giving back. I think always just being aware of what an organization like Maddie Rose has to offer, um, bringing your children here, having the children interact with the, the kids from this community, and obviously just any support to offer uh, an organization like Maddie Rose that gives so much back to this community is always very important. Any opportunity to work with Maddie Rose and everything they give to the community, it's, it's, these are the projects that matter. These are the projects why we go to work every day, to work with McCown Gordon and, and all the wonderful people at Maddie Rose, and ultimately so that children can have this wonderful experience uh, it's just it's so very rewarding. 
So Matty Rules is the best thing. You you get to play and stuff, and you get to have so much fun. And 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 after and after all the schoolwork you can do, you can go have some fun at Matty Rose. Ah, pues mira qué padre. Aquí estamos en el Matty Rose. Es la apertura del de edificio cultural de arte y es un orgullo, un orgullo no solamente hispano, pero para la comunidad. Increíble. Estamos celebrando con con grupos folclóricos. Así ahorita vienen los mariachis, tienen DJ, tienen paletas, una fiesta. Va a ser increíble. Lo, lo, que me, lo que me encanta de esto es que, que puedes entrar y puedes ver arte de nuestros niños, de la comunidad, que están haciendo, que están aprendiendo. Y también en el futuro va a haber artistas que vienen con arte en México, en Los Ángeles, arte chicano, arte mexicano, de todo. Y el orgullo que va a traer, no solamente, como les digo, en, la, en nuestra comunidad, pero todo Kansas City para que vean que ese es el lugar y una maravilla. ¿Desde cuándo? Año, ¿Cuántos años tratando de hacer esto? Y, y me da como quién sabe qué. Um, estoy dibujando un como mountain de un viewing. Uh, yo pienso que este lugar es para todos que se ponen sus cosas como dibujos. Maddie Road Center is located in both the west side neighborhood and historic northeast and we have councilman bunch as our representative so this is this is a really fantastic evening and i uh as you as, as john mentioned this this is in the heart of the fourth district that i represent as well as a lot of the most of the historic northeast and so i'm proud to have maddie Rhodes in two locations or two point two and a half locations, I guess, um, uh, within the fourth district. I, I appreciate all the hard work that, that you do in revitalizing communities, providing great cultural opportunities for uh, for 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 kids. My my own kid, actually, uh, one of my twin daughters participated in our program just up the street here, and uh, to have a dedicated space like this that that is flexible, creates opportunities for the community to get involved and, and to really create more opportunities for local artists. Uh, so one of my favorite local artists, uh, a, a mural in the back room, uh, super exciting to see that kind of, that, that kind of commitment to the community uh, really manifest itself right here. And, and, and yeah, the city participated in this and I think uh, we were a part of it, but really this is something for the whole community and something uh, that Matty Rhodes and uh, the city at large can really be proud of. So thanks for everything that you all do in the community and thanks uh, for continuing to be such an important player and such an important part of, of, of building a better Kansas City. So give me wisdom the concert at your throne and do not reject me from among your children. For I am your servant, the child of your maidservant, a man weak and short-lived and lacking in comprehension of judgment and of laws. Indeed, though one be perfect among mortals, if wisdom who comes from you be lacking, that one will count for nothing. Send her forth from your holy heavens and from your glorious throne. Dispatch her that she may be with me and work with me that I may know what is pleasing to you. For she knows and understands all things and will guide me prudently in my affairs and safeguard me by her glory. Thus my needs will be acceptable and I will judge your people justly and be worthy of my father's throne the word of the lord let us pray lord god almighty in your kindness hear our prayers we dedicate this building the cultural center of mary rose to the education of youth children and all different peoples who will benefit from it to the progress of the sciences and to learn it. May it become a center where the students and teachers will search for the wisdom that guides the Christian life and strive wholeheartedly to stand by Christ as their teacher who lives and reigns forever and ever. And may the blessing of mighty God come down upon this place in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
yo me llamo John Fierro, soy el director ejecutivo del centro de Mary Rhodes. Habremos el nuevo centro cultura de Mary Rhodes y uh, aquí estamos con la comunidad. Pues en el tiempo que nosotros estamos trabajando con nuestra comunidad, la gente tiene confianza en nosotros, en los servicios y cuando hablamos a ellos a decir vienes a festear, aquí están. Soy mexicano, mi mamá um, vine de México y ella nomás hablaba puro español y esta comunidad, el West Side, es mi casa. Y yo fui a escuela aquí y para tener uh, la oportunidad de ser el uh, líder de este centro y este nuevo Centro Cultura es muy especial y estoy pensando a mi, mi mamá. Well, you know, we want everybody to know that this center belongs to the community. So we want to hear from the community if they have ideas on using the space. We want to be able to make that available. We want people to come for all of the First Friday events and have a good time and just meet new friends. The history of Maddie Road Center has been about community. And I, I really see this as a next chapter in our history that we are going to continue to meet the needs of the community, whether that be education, cultural arts, youth development, what have you. And I just want the community to know that we continue to listen to you and be responsive to what you're saying is needed so that all of our, our community members can reach their full potential. It is definitely a dream to have a, a gathering place where people from all ethnicities can come together and have a good time. And you know, my dream is still much bigger. So I, 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 I tell the people that are listening that, you know, a couple of things that we want to work on is providing early childhood education, also providing some parenting education classes and health care. So hopefully if, uh, if, if we can identify the resources, we will be opening up other buildings in the near future. Gracias a ustedes y uh, es un placer tener um, esta relación que estamos trabajando con Televida. Ustedes hacen un buen trabajo a presentar qué está pasando en la comunidad y de parte del Centro de Mary Rhodes. Gracias a ustedes. Muchísimas gracias a todos los que nos acompañaron en la gran apertura del Centro de Cultura de Mary Rhodes Center. Oh, 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 oh,